All set for a start. And they're off in the Pegasus World Cup turf. From the far outside, Never Surprise comes out firing. In the center, Doswell has speed. Colonel Liam put into play today to try to get some forward position. Flavius is out the rail and Channel Cat is out wide. Then back to cross border down at the inside and headstrong there fighting the rating. It's a tone. Down at the inside, hit the road is inconvenienced. On heels is March to the arch. Wide on the course went field pass. Second last is Space Traveler. The early trailer is Sacred Life as they look for some position around the first turn. It's Never Surprise to cross over from the high draw. He leads by a length and a half over Doswell in second and Flavius third. Colonel Liam, the defending champion, is fourth at this stage in the two path, about three lengths behind. Channel Cat is on his outside. Then it's back to a tone ahead of field pass. Moving on his inside and cross border, followed by hit the road. He's seven lengths behind. March to the arch is third last. Second last is the world traveler, space traveler, and the trailer is sacred life as they make their way half a mile from the finish. Never surprised in a bid to make all. He leads by a length and a quarter. Doswell latched on to him second and Flavius is third. No excuses here for Colonel Liam. He's in the clear. He's getting a good trip. Three wide and starting to improve. Far outside in Channel Cat, then a tone. Hit the road is held up in traffic, so is cross border. Wide on the course and march to the arch, saving ground space traveler. Sacred life with no place to go. Seven lengths from first to last as Colonel Liam makes a bid for the lead. Never surprised his barn buddy has inside position and is still right there. has done it again. Todd Pletcher has done it again. Made everyone sweat a little bit who had bet on the favorite, but pulls it off at the end. He looked like a winner to me all the time. As we said earlier, Matt and I, he's got tactical early speed, so he put his jockey, Rad Ortiz Jr., not far off the lead going into the first turn. He didn't have the inside trip he did last year. He was too wide and then pushed three wide, but still a really good trip for a, for a turf race, and he was just the best horse. And credit to the other Pletcher horse in here. Never surprised to see him on the front end right now. Luis Saez did a great job of getting him to relax a little bit. But I think when push comes to shove, you see as they roll from the top of the lane here, I just think Colonel Liam's just a superior animal, point blank. He, he is. And Todd Pletcher, uh, as we mentioned, is, is good or better getting a horse ready off a layoff six months plus in this particular case. So, yeah, a bright year ahead for Colonel Liam. Looks like he's picking off where he left off last year. Back-to-back -back years, Pletcher goes 1-2 in this race. And Erat Ortiz Jr., he's won this race three of his four runnings. He was second the other time. Yeah, bricks and mortar in 2019. Colonel Liam just last year. Colonel Liam again this as year. As Aaron Rodgers would say, Erat owns this race. <laughs> owns it. Owns yes. it big time yes. in this this race for sure.